Hi everybody, this is Joel from Spot Home Paris. Today we're visiting a very nice one bedroom flat in Boissy Saint Léger. If you don't know where Boissy Saint Léger is, it's very close to Paris, it's very near. It's 18 minutes on the Oreo. Let me check the little leaflet that I wrote down everything on it. So it's, a, so it's 18 minutes on the Oreo from Paris, it's very close. It's 15 minutes on the Oreo to the castle of Vincennes, the Chateau de Vincennes. Uh, this house is actually, because this is a big house, separated in four different uh, apartments. So there's like, uh, this one is a one bedroom, as I said, and here is 300 meters or 400 meters from the Oreo, which is a suburban train, which is really, really close. You get, you get there in five minutes. It's really, really handy to be here. Uh, there's a garden with a lot of fruits outside, like there's figs, uh, cherries, um, every, I mean, pff, it's really great in the summer. In the winter it's not bad either this is located on the first floor of this house the landlord lives and uh, the landlord and landlady live downstairs and um, they're really nice people they're really uh, always here to help if you if you need um, and yeah so let me this place so give you an overview first you can see the decoration and everything so here there's a you can see this little um, cabinet where you get a bit of storage space mainly drawers and a couple of shelves in there and on your left hand side you get the bathroom space with this kind of door it's like an, kind of an accordion kind of door see um, you get the you get a base in there you get a toilet and you get a shower cabin with all with tiles around it right uh, easy to maintain easy to clean uh, you get a mirror here all right and you get this electrical uh, bottle warmer thing it's like that, that, that basically warms your the water for the whole uh, flat and obviously you get the vent in case it steams up and you get a little shelf here and a few coat hangers right let's move on to this place which is the kitchen you've guessed and you see there's a window here it's quite bright actually you can see it's a gloomy day today it's not really sunny in paris but you know you, you, there's still a lot of light coming in as you can see there you get in the sink you get a base in there you get a stove with two electrical um, stoves, actually. There's a storage space up here with a lot of uh, uh, pans, saucepans, and um, and bowls and everything. You get another storage space here, and uh, you get sugar. How lucky you are! And there you get. Um, there's a fridge here. There's a fridge with a little freezer compartment there. There's more storage space. Actually, I should leave that open. There's more storage space here. There. There's a washing machine around this corner. There. And you get more storage space, I guess, with cutlery and stuff. Look at that. I guess, right. Cutlery. And basically, you get everything that you need in them. Um, there's even a wok, see? Um, you get everything that you need in this kitchen. Then let's move on. Oh no, no, let's not move on. There's also the oven here. That's a grill and a microwave oven as well. So it's important that I don't forget it. So now we can move on to the actual living room. You get this um, piece of furniture there. I don't know. I don't want to call it a cabinet. It's kind of a it's kind of a library, but it's used to uh, to put plates and uh, mugs and all that, as you can see. Also books. So it is kind of library with very good books. You can see German all here. Very famous book from French writer Emile Zola. Um, there's a to there's a toaster, there's a kettle, and a coffee maker, I believe. There, more books, a few glasses, and uh, yeah, more storage space here. There's a nice round table. There's a, you got like fold up chairs over there that you can use to uh, to sit down and have a meal together with um, with your best friends around here. Um, here you can see a part of the garden. Like this is actually a cherry tree you can see there, and there's a fig, there's a fig tree here and another fig tree over there on the corner, um, and you get like this bed here, so double bed, so and you get a TV on top of it over there with a shelf, and here you can see there's an AC unit. There's also a heater for the whole house. It's electrical and uh, it's cool. I mean, in in the summer you'd be happy to have AC. When you get really sunny days in Paris, and um, it's always good, always good to have it. Um, there's a here a BZ couch which unfolds like this, uh, so obviously you can turn it, and you can you know there's like a two people, there's room for two people on it. Here you get a bedroom with this desk here, a bit of storage shelves here with a rack you need to uh, to uh, dry your clothes. There's a bunk bed here with a single 
a single uh, space there with a lamp you see and a bit on the side and there's a double bed downstairs and you get those uh this little stairs to um to get in it so there's this little built-in actually no it's a kind of a it's kind of half built-in half standalone wardrobe because you can see it's been fitted um in it so there's um uh, there's a chair as i told you about there's like four five there's five chairs um you get those hangers here uh, you get a hoover and you get a, a couple of drawers here and a few shelves you can see there's like the towels and everything and um and a mirror again hello uh and also you can see uh, let me show you actually this is a very quiet street it's very very quiet and it's worth to say that here you right in the you in the right space between countryside and city because as i said you're less than 20 minutes from paris and you can see all this it's very rural right it's very like you can see like a, another um fruit fruity tree um this i mean you can see the the, the way the house is, is it's laid there's a courtyard it's really calm it's a calm street and just five minutes from here you get a forest yeah an actual forest where you can go and uh like you know just uh, have a walk and it, there's like mushrooms and uh, people like to go and pick mushrooms don't ask me why uh, there's flowers there's even like you know wild wildlife is just around the corner from here it's really crazy you get also you also get everything convenient as in if you need to go shopping for food and everything it's also around the corner so basically you get best of both worlds it's a really i think it's a really interesting place if you're looking to be near paris but also want to have a look at the french countryside i think this is the place to be well i think i've said it all guys i've talked a lot now i'll let you i'll leave you to it uh it was nice to see you again uh, thank you for watching this was joel from spot home paris a bientôt